All right, Coach, a uh, huge matchup this week coming off a of bye week. Yeah, number 12, uh, Walford. Uh, let's talk about the big game. Well, it's a big game. It's very similar to a year ago when they came in here. They were, I think, number six in the country, and we were fortunate enough to win that one. But, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to going. I know our players are. Our bye did come at a great time, and then, you know, this time a week ago, we probably had 10 or 11 kids that have been down for the game. Now we're hopefully going to have everybody back, which we're going to need. Uh, you know, every time we play Wofford, it seems like it comes down to, you know, the fourth quarter, the last drive, and, you know, I don't have any reason to suspect that it won't. Uh, do the same this this time, but uh, you know I like our football team. I've been saying that since last spring. And, uh, it'll be a big test for us. Uh, you know we, we played App and Georgia Southern the last two games that we played. Wofford was, was the third when all three of those those teams were in the playoffs a year ago. Uh, so uh, you know we'll we'll find out where we are this week and then we'll get ready for another one the, the next week. Coach, what's the what, what's the biggest challenge for you this week? You know, once again, you, you just uh, you just said it all, but uh, your program has played uh, you know two top tens, you know two teams already this year that you know have has big you know. Well, you know, it was a, it was a process of us growing, and uh, you know just like the way we came back and beat Wofford a, a year ago, uh, you know we lost the week uh, prior against App on the last play of the game. But we've won our last five conference games, and, you know, I, we've gotten better as a team, better as a program. Uh, they believe in themselves, and you know, they're playing hard. It'll come down to what we, we always talk about, uh, turnovers, penalties, the kicking game. And, uh, you know, so uh, we know what we got to do. We just got to go do it. You're ranked number 22 in one poll, but not ranked in the coaches' poll. Feel any little disrespect there from, in that certain poll? I kind of honestly I do, but you know we can't worry about that right now. I know we got a good football team, and uh, I think the people that are players will tell you that. Coach, what is the biggest thing uh, you, know, you, you mentioned the bye week? What was the biggest thing you worked on uh, improving during the bye week? And going to well, you know, I think every time uh, you have a bye week, uh, there's some different things, but there's some constant things. Number one, we went back and did some self scouting on us. Uh, second thing is you try to heal up your injured The third thing you want to do is, is get a lot of reps to some guys that maybe hadn't gotten the reps uh, that they need, that you're going to need them throughout the remainder of the year. And then another thing that I think is real important is on our last pad day, of, uh, we went out and we had uh, a scrimmage with the guys that didn't you know, hadn't been playing a whole lot. And that brings a lot of enthusiasm. You get, you know, the offensive guys who play defensive guys who play for each other. And, uh, so when you can get that going, it, it, it helps more out. Yeah, it does.